pretty much it. All right, so yeah. we can mark Why am I chinny? It's because I'm... it's actually cold. Nice. My character Sue is a lovely young woman <laughs> um, who has intense intense anxiety when it comes to performing and singing live. She is a guitarist and performs in a local pub, but uh, during the course of the film, a clip of her singing goes viral, and uh, and then everything changes. What drew you to that role specifically? Uh, it's funny actually when this when this role came about um, I read the script and I was um, Kristen gave me the option of choosing out two roles uh, but this particular role really spoke to me because it just felt like it was me to be honest because I also have uh, performance anxiety when it comes to singing and so I think it will it's really funny it's like the universe aligned in order to give me something to face my fear. That's wonderful. So it's a growth yeah. opportunity. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. And you actually have to have a shot for real. For real. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Or do? It feels faster. Hey guys, I'm Janelle Marie and I play Janie. Um, Janie's really interesting. Uh, she's actually in the Air Force and she's coming home, super excited to be home and be reunited with her girlfriend Sue. And it's been a struggle because she hasn't been here for six months and she just wants to make the relationship work and some things happen where she realizes how much she really does love and care about her. That she wants to like make things right and lock it down and also she cares so much about Sue. She's a, I feel like my character is uh, very giving and supportive and just like wants to help and very helpful even though like sometimes Sue, like her partner, just is like, no, like, I can do it, I can fend for myself, so, uh, which is really like interesting because I myself have some of those qualities as well. I love um, giving back and like helping my friends out whenever possible. But I also can relate to uh, Sue Dom's character because sometimes we're all independent and we think that we can do it all by ourselves and it's okay to get some help from others. That's awesome. Years of <laughs> my name is Laura Allen. I play the character of Mardu. And Mardu is Theo's sister, also his best woman. And she ends up coming in from out of town. She's a music producer and ends up sweeping Iris off her feet. I love how the storylines intertwine. I love that my storyline with Iris is, it's just a love story. It's kind of an unlikely love story and it's about somebody that you've known for so long and the right person being there the whole time. And having that person there who's, who's just been a part of your life that you know you're right for and getting to know each other as friends and then falling in love. My name is Emily Goss and I'm playing Iris. Iris is, by some people's accounts, the perfect woman. But, you know, of course, like any person that we assume has it all together, she doesn't. And um, one of the most devastating things that can happen to someone happens to her. And she is very resilient and she pulls herself out of heartbreak and really finds the person she was always meant to be. When you're doing a comedy, and especially a romantic comedy, it's, it's such a gift to have people that you trust on set because you're often vulnerable. Either you're doing ridiculous things, like being outrageously drunk, you know, I don't know who does that in this movie, but, um, or, or, you're, or you're falling in love. And so the fact that we have such a caring, empathetic crew has just made this process really beautiful. My name is Sandra May Frank. My sign name is Sandra. And in the deaf community, we have sign names to represent each other. We don't speak, so we use sign language. And so my sign name, or my name is Sandra. I play Kenna in this film. And it's really the dream character. She's a welder, and she lives her life kind of at the cuff, off the cuff, and she's just a very strong character. And I can identify with her in many ways, as a deaf person, as a deaf woman, individually as well. She speaks her mind. She's funny. She's funny. 
and she's brilliant and she's on the spot and she has no fear. She's very confident and that kind of role is what we need for a deaf character. She is not a victim. She is not the outcast or outsider. She is, she doesn't often want pity. Often roles in films with TV or deaf theater, you know, it is that way. But I'm just very excited that she's an all around person she doesn't have she has her nervous moments she has her shy moments in and she has her in love moments the first love at first sight it's just like everybody else and i think that's really beautiful to share and on top of it we have language yeah. amazing Oh, hey, I'm Jessica Clark, and I am playing Lou in A Season of Love. And Lou is a little bit of a mess. She's super fun, a uh, workaholic. Um, she is opening a brewery, and she gets very overwhelmed by life. Um, so I'm having a lot of fun playing her. I love, I love A Season of Love um, because it's a rom-com like we never I feel like queer people gay people all of our movies as wonderful as some of them are are very sort of in the dramatic genre and you know there's a lot of tears and all of that stuff and this is funny it's sweet it's you know it's sexy because you know hello hot women but um, it's you know it's it's a love actually for um, <laughs> and the writing is really good and everyone is really great in it and it makes me laugh when I just hear people running their lines so um, yeah I'm pretty confident that you guys are gonna love it hi to everybody who supported and back this project thank you so so much. This has been a blast to be a part of and I cannot wait for you to see Season of Love. Thank you so much for your support. We would not be doing this without you and we can't wait for you to see it. absolutely excited for you guys to watch this film. Thank you so much for having our back and supporting us in fundraising for this film. Thank you, thank you. This would not be able to happen without you and I look forward to seeing you there in the winter. I want to take a minute to thank all of you out there that have contributed towards the making of this absolutely amazing, awesome, funny, sweet, loving holiday movie. Um, I'm so excited to be a part of it. I'm so excited for you guys, everyone, to see it. Um, I'm, I'm excited to just have something like this out there. So thank you very, very much. I want to say thank you so, so much for your support, all the love that you guys have given us to make this possible, to make this movie possible and bring it to life and to your screens. I really hope you enjoyed as much as I've enjoyed making it. So I will see you guys on the other side of the screen after the movie's made. You know what I mean? So thank you. <laughs> thank you to all the wonderful fans out there. You guys are such amazing human beings and I cannot wait for you to see it. We're having such a good time on set filming. And yeah, enjoy.